Hi everyone. How are you today? I hope you are always healthy. Welcome back to my channel. Like always, today I'm going to discuss some topic that will make you wonder about the advanced technology of the past, and more. I got this on various sources. Please check the description to know more, there are many interesting topics there, and not all of them can be covered here. I know that my video quality is far from good, but I hope the content is understandable. Some might say that I'm being repetitive by discussing this. But that's the whole point. This is proof that a small occult elite of the history to fit their narrative. Anyway, I also have a Telegram channel. There, I will share various information that I cannot share here. Don't forget to subscribe to my backup YouTube channel, the link is also in the description box below. So, without further ado, fasten your pants and let's get started. Klinky's 17th century atlas, from which the images of the Tartars and Muscovites were taken, is worth looking at not only in scanned form, but also in real size. Look, don't get confused. The page format is 1.75 by 1.9 meters. In Paris Lovell Zaleski, there is a copy of the Gospel of Enormous Eyes. From the photo, I think the size of such books is clear. For people of our stature, and we are told that over the past centuries the population has increased in stature considerably, due to nutrition and comfortable conditions for life, such weight is prohibitive, even for weightlifters, for a gift version they are not worthy, and for their carrying or use, special mechanisms are needed. Dozens of similar editions have survived, where even the font is excessive for a person of normal height. The sons of God began to enter into the daughters of men. From this were born giants. Shall we add books to the selection of tall doors and pictures of giants? Pyramids found on the Antarctica, and only God knows how many more are over there under all the snow. Which proves there was a same civilization on all of the continents, prior to the Ice Age or weather manipulation from the evil parasites controlling the Earth. This is the real reason why there is Atlantic Treaty in the first place, due to so many of these structures still being under snow and ice. This evidence goes against everything we have been taught in school, and shatters the false narrative of how civilization started out very primitive and became more technologically advanced. We were never primitive, at least not here on Earth. Before I continue the video, please give a like if you'd learned something. And, don't forget to subscribe, and also, click the notification bell too, so you won't miss any update. And, watch to the end, to avoid misunderstanding. Thank you. Nikola Tesla's tower also was placed on top of an underground water system the same way Giza was, to harness the piezoelectricity of the currents via mechanical stress of water, given that water itself is a crystalline structured element. The Washington Monument's purpose is likely built atop a similar water system, and used in the exact same way to distribute energy, along with all the other obelisks constructed around the Earth. Hence the Washington Monument literally nesting inside the sacred geometric pattern of the Vesica Pisces, an important sacred geometric pattern vital to creationalism itself, denoting the synthesis, or birth, of energy from zero point, or ether, which gives rise to every sacred pattern thereafter required for the biology of everything in the visible universe. One song. The biggest cover-up in history, is history itself, and how energy has played a role in it. This rabbit hole just keeps on getting even deeper. Earlier today, I was contacted by two individuals that had heard about another twist on the Balenciaga controversy. As I detailed before, extremely disturbing Balenciaga photographs that prominently feature children are causing a tremendous uproar all over the world. In one of those photographs, there is a roll of pre-printed tape on the floor, on which the name of the company has been purposely altered. 
Instead of spelling it as Balenciaga, an X-ray has been added so that it is spelled Balenciaga instead. I had to try this for myself, and so, I pulled up Google's Latin to English translator. Sure enough, when I typed Balenciaga into the Latin box, it told me that the English translation of that phrase is Ball the King. When I first saw that, I was absolutely floored. Did they truly believe that nobody would notice? Or maybe they did want people to notice. These days, the elite are becoming much more bold in their promotion of the occult. And at this point, the number of young people that are interested in the occult is absolutely exploding. If you doubt this, just check out these numbers. TikTok, the popular social media platform that is known for quick videos, one-minute dance challenges, and its viral trends, is now being recognized as a hub for witches and warlocks. Videos with the hashtag WitchTalk have amassed more than 30 billion views and have made it easier for would-be witches or those interested in the occult to learn more about it, according to the BBC. TikTok's witch hashtag has received nearly 20 billion views, which TikTok has nearly 2 billion views, and baby witch, a hashtag for those new to the dark craft, has more than 600 million views. Our young people are watching witchcraft videos on TikTok billions and billions of times. Sadly, many of them end up becoming deeply immersed in that world. For example, one young woman named Jenny Weaver said that she originally got into it innocently, but then she quickly learned that the realm of the occult is very real. I had such a fear that gripped my life. It crippled me. The next thing that I knew, I was seeing things, hearing things, and I was being tortured by demonic spirits that had come in through the use of witchcraft. It was a very scary time. I didn't even want to close my eyes to wash my face. I was that terrified. If you think that it is innocent, I am telling you, it will take you down a road you do not want to go down. And I had to ask the Lord Jesus Christ to forgive me. If you are reading this, and you are thinking that this is just a bunch of fairly tales, then you are greatly mistaken. The world of darkness is just as real as you are. And millions of our young people are being seduced. Thankfully, we live in times when the light is going to shine brighter than ever, even as darkness grows all around us. At this stage, the elite aren't even trying to hide who they really serve anymore. Many among the elite are truly obsessed with the world of darkness, and popular culture has become absolutely saturated with occult themes. We are in a battle for the hearts and minds of our young people, and we must not let darkness win. What do you think about this video? Please like and share this video if you like it, so that more people are aware of what is happening in this world. Before I end this video, let's say thank you to everyone who took the time and energy to research this, they have done a lot for us all. Please subscribe to watch the next upcoming videos. Thank you for watching the video until the end, I hope this information is useful for all of us. See you in the next video.